friends, it's me. Today we're gonna be busting our brains on some riddles. And I found out that she was pregnant. Eric was so happy. I put on my good orange pants for this. He took care of Anna and did whatever she wanted. Wow, what a good hubby. Even though he got carrots for legs. One morning, Anna woke Eric up. Eric, I'm going to have the baby. Let's go to the hospital. <laughs> that chill. I ain't never heard a nine month pregnant woman say, wake up, let's go to the hospital. I'm gonna have this baby. It's more like, ah, take me to the hospital. This baby like the Wells Fargo wagon, he's a coming. Eric got up and they got into the car and went to the hospital. Unfortunately, there was a terrible traffic jam on the way. Y'all better move over. We got a baby on board. Eric got out of the car to see what can be done. Bro, just, <laughs> this is an emergency. I mean, you know what, maybe it's not. She didn't even yell at him. Which car should drive back to clear the road? Oh, you see, I've been in my fair share of traffic jams. Three needs to get the heck out of the way so that one and two can go. See, you're not supposed to go in the middle lane and block it. You are a fool. So are you number six and number four. Like, like what, what is this traffic jam? Y'all just want to be petty. There's not even that many cars out in the road. Yeah, see, I told you. I'm an expert on this. Wow! It was literally that one car that caused all that hoopla. Speaking of hoopla, today's video is sponsored by 88 Fish Shot. 88 Fish Shot has two games. One Shot and 88 Fish. Both games have free practice access and you don't have to sign up for them. If you like Dragon Ball, you're gonna like One Shot. The purpose of the game is to collect all seven Dragon Balls and summon the dragon. Hmm, sound familiar? The game is super addicting and super easy to play. There's like a quick tutorial showing you how to play before you start. Just shoot all the fishies and cash in all those payback gold coins. Each shot costs a minimum of 0.1 gold coin and each kill will pay you back a certain amount of gold coins. So you pew pew, you give you take. Different fish give you different gold coins. The more the payback, the higher the score. And if you kill the dragon, you get a 500 times bonus. So there's a huge contest that'll be held the first of the month. And if you sign up using my code sniper, you get 20 gold coins for free. And it'll work on either one shot or 88 fish. But hold on, there's another contest. At the end of every single day, there is a cash prize for the top 10 players that day. First place gets $300. They're giving out over $20,000 a month for the biggest daily prize contest. So when you win a prize, it'll be deposited into the player's wallet. And to cash out, you just email this email with your user ID shown in the wallet photo. This is a fair competition and everyone has a fair chance of winning. It's a super easy game to play and there's a guaranteed winner every single day with real money prizes. You play it on PC or mobile, so I'm challenging you guys. Use code SNIPER for free entry into the contest and try to win $8,888. The winner will be one player with the highest score in October to November from any of the two games and the winner will be announced on November 30th. I'm gonna show you how this game works firsthand. We gonna go expert, because I tried master and it, it was too hard. Newbie's too easy. Master is too hard, okay? I don't want to show you guys me struggling, okay? So I'm gonna upgrade the cannon. We gon' do the electricity. So you see how I upgraded it to 10? We're gonna destroy all the little fish. And when we're not destroying the little fish, we are gonna destroy the dragon. You see this dude? He carrying the dragon ball. And right now, we don't even have the first dragon ball. So the goal is to shoot all the fishies in my way and take out the mini dragons, okay? So we take their dragon ball and then we can summon the big dragon. Oh my god, they're in my way. You see, I was distracted explaining it and I couldn't get it in time. So different fish give you different points. Oh, I got my strong attack. Where's the Dragon Ball Turtle? You see, it's a turtle, but I'm gonna call it a dragon, okay? Because this looks like a mini dragon, but you can't tell me this is a turtle. <laughs> it's like a dragon turtle, okay? So, we're gonna take him out. Out of my way, hammerhead. With your big ol' head. Okay, I really need to stop. Everybody's in the way when I'm trying to get my dragon ball. You see these big frog? This dude gives you so many points. You missed. A 
Okay, you see, I got that Dragon Ball. Now I have two. Please have mercy. So basically, we're gonna destroy all these other sea creatures until another Dragon Ball appears. And then we're gonna keep going at it till we get seven. And once you get seven, you summon the dragon, and that boy give you so many points when you defeat him. Oh, another Dragon Ball. Oh, now we got three. So I'm gonna be signing up for the $20,000 tournament and I'm gonna be playing. So make sure you guys sign up. See if you can beat me. Link is in the description below. Check it out. How was he alive? At 5 p.m. he was chilling in his big comfy chair doing millionaire things. Wait, 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 wait. 4 p.m. he knocked out at the end of a flight of stairs. And then 5 p.m. he chilling on his big comfy couch drinking some juice. Oh, that's not juice. I know what that is and I know what you are. Say it. Say it. <laughs> Vampire! Vampire. Bro, this is exactly like that scene from Twilight. He's even got red eyes. Maybe he was born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline. Yeah, see, exactly, he's a vampire. <laughs> That's so stupid. I don't know who has a hanging portrait of them on their wall that says their birth date and then a dash and then they leave some space for the day that you die. Does anyone do that? Who's pregnant with an alien? Oh man, that's a lot of bellies. Doctors freaking out like, oh, where do I start? This is how they probably used to do it in the 1900s. All the pregnant ladies would just come in and be like, oh, doctor, is it okay? Does it look okay? Okay, A looks normal. B, oh jeez. B is just part fish. That's Aquaman's baby. C, ooh, I'm not a doctor, so like, I, I don't know. That's, oh man, it could be. C, C, she having a puffer fish. A, is it just shiny? Maybe she's taking all her vitamins. She's glowing from the inside out. I honestly want to see what all y'all's baby daddies look like. Something tells me they ain't all human. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go with C. Seems too obvious. I'm gonna go with A. She swallowed a glow stick or a lamp. <laughs> her tummy is radiating. Definitely unusual. The other two could be sick. You hear that? Y'all sick. Whatever you had for lunch ain't it. Okay, but who's pregnant with an alien? Send all of them to the ranch. Father, our daughter has run away from home. We're panicking. Oh no, I've never heard somebody say, uh, we're panicking. You just like do it. You don't say it, you do it. <laughs> And he looks so chill, look at him. Why could this happen? I don't know, he looked like the type of dad to throw the chancla. Smash like if your parents used to throw shoes. <laughs> Mother's like, we have a wonderful relationship. Jenny always was a perfect kid. All right, one, she's pregnant. Two, and it's Jesus. I'm just kidding, but she totally could be pregnant and she's scared and she just like ran away with her boyfriend because she doesn't know what to do. I mean, that sounds legit. We had no problems with her, even in adolescence. See, that's what all the parents say. All the parents would be like, Oh, we love our child. Our child is perfect. We've never fought a day in our life. <laughs> I was always proud of Jenny. <gasps> the boyfriend is there. What? Sorry, dude. She ran away with another guy. She probably got pregnant. It was like, oh, heck, what do I do? Runs away. We had so many plans. Like moving to California way together and entering the university. I don't understand why she left. Maybe she found another guy. Her sister says, I don't think she found any. Anybody. She truly loves you. Why did Jenny run away? Man, all you gonna give me is a oh, boom, boom. <laughs> Instantly looking at this, I know why she ran away. And I was right. Jenny is pregnant. I see in the trash can. You just like walk into her room, take one look into her trash can. That girl be pregnant and it ain't her boyfriend. Oh man, that sucks. I will run away too. Jenny found out she was pregnant. She was afraid of disappointing her parents and telling her boyfriend that their plans were ruined. Oh my God. See what I tell you? Man, that sucks. Sucks. Poor boyfriend waiting around like I hope she comes back. Sorry boyfriend. Jenny from the block been around the block You know what I mean? What's wrong here? <gasps> Does he have a Batman backpack? Send him to the ranch. That's illegal around these parts, sir. No, really what's wrong with this photo? Oh the door <laughs> I love how this whole entire classroom scene, teacher angry at the student, was all a distraction because the door hinges are on the wrong side. Wow, you really got me. You really done bamboozled me with this one, huh? I'll admit defeat. On this fine summer day, a child was stolen from the playground. There were no strangers nearby. Then how did it happen? 
happen? But you mean there was no strangers nearby? So you let Billy run off into the woods? Like, oh, there was no strangers. So I let him run free. I know all the parents who walk around here. Oh, you know all of them? Let's talk to them. These women walk with their kids here for several years. Any of them could hardly do this. Oh, but you don't know that and you don't know them. The police found some videos of the playground taken over the past two years. Oh, they guessed who the kidnapper was right away? Oh, okay, let's take a look at the photos. Who did it? Instantly, my eyes go to the woman with the carriage. Okay, in the last photo, there's what appears to be a happy couple with a child. The child looks pretty happy too, but the child also looks like no face from Spirited Away. But anyway, those people did not have a child to begin with. They didn't even go to this park. Man, I'm looking at this and I'm trying to figure it out. I don't know. This requires a lot of brain power. There's a lot going on in these photos. Oh, it's the woman in the carriage. Oh, I saw her first and then I was like, mm. In two years, the child should have outgrown the cradle. Oh, you make a valuable point. So you're telling me this woman right here is going to the park over two years with an empty cradle. I mean, what if she had multiple babies? Maybe she was stealing them, putting them into the empty cradle. You don't know that. But also, you don't know if she had two babies. Like, she had a baby, and then she had another baby, which is pretty common. I feel like y'all asking for a lawsuit. This evidence would not work in real life. That woman could be totally innocent. Anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And comment below which ones you got right and which one you got wrong. And no, you didn't get all of them right. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click. Click. And make sure you subscribe to the Wolfpack. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.